We're going to tell you a story. There's a place called the Prickly Hippie that we go to quite often, uh, every every Saturday pretty because much. Because it's awesome. It's a good place. Good. It's a cafe. It's it, In fact, it's the Prickly Hippie. It's coffee and, and cactus. Cake. Coffee, ca cactus, and cakes. Yeah, in one place. So we show up, and it's, it's like a handful of us. But the important part is Anthony. Anthony's walking ahead of me. And when he goes in, he goes to do this little suave turn and his backpack knocks him off as he steps off the corner of the floor mat. Anthony, which you're talking about, has the grace of a ballerina, like a soccer-wielding ballerina. He steps on the floor mat and he takes a nosedive into the plants, this row of cactuses and, and big plants. And it is, and this is not a graceful fall. This is like the continuum falling and he's grabbing things to slow himself down, but everything he grabs is breakable. <laughs> So Anthony goes in and he he looks like an Olympic diver from my point of view, just making a perfect dive into these plants. So he just kept falling. Of course, it's getting the attention of everybody in this otherwise quiet. <laughs> you know, he finally stops and the dust settles and he stands up real quickly. And then you can see it in his eyes that he didn't hurt himself. He just hurt his pride. A little here and a little here. So we ended up designing this this prickly hippie card. <laughs> of course, it says, <laughs> you know, it's a trip, which was funny to us.